Hi friends, in this video, we are going to see types of DC generator. So types of DC generator depends on the connection of field winding in a generator and how it is excited. So based on that, uh, excitation given to field winding we have two types of generators separately excited or self excited In self excited, we have further two types. Shunt generator and series generator. So let's see this one by one. Separately excited generator. So as the name suggests, we have different DC supply given to the field winding and from the armature we are taking a voltage out. So the circuit diagram of a separately excited generator will be like this. We are having a field winding. That is excited by a DC supply. These are the terminals F1, F2. So obviously the current IF will flow. It will produce a flux required so that cutting of this flux by armature will induce EMF in the armature conductor. Armature is shown like this. and load is connected so generator is shown like this this is how it is going to develop the EMF these are the terminals A1 A2 and armature current IA will be same as this IL okay, and it will develop a terminal voltage across load which is VT so this is a load let's write voltage and current relations Now, here we can say armature current is nothing but a load current and we can say terminal voltage Vt is nothing but E minus IARA or practically I can say whatever EMF got induced over here at the armature side that EMF need to supply voltage to the load that is a terminal voltage Vt plus it need to supply the voltage drop across armature conductors and that is given by IARA where RA is armature resistance plus brushes are there because with the help of brushes, we are taking a current and voltage out of the armature. So obviously we will have some small amount of brush drop. So 
so this is a voltage equation of separately excited generator now here flux phi is independent of ia or whatever emf got induced so it's purely depend upon a separate dc supply hence it is called as a separately excited generator and if i fix this dc supply so flux phi will remain constant so it is also called as constant flux generator shunt generator now the circuit diagram of a shunt generator will be like this this is a generator and it's a armature so it is having terminals a1 and a2 this is a field winding terminals f1 f2 and rsh is the resistance of this field winding currents are like this if then i a like this and here we will have load current i l which will develop terminal voltage across load so here field winding is parallel with armature winding or you can say field winding is in shunt with armature winding hence it is called as shunt generator if it is parallel so obviously whatever the terminal voltage or whatever the emf induced generated it will serve a field current if over here so we must be thinking if voltage is not induced how come this can be excited so first of all the flux that is there which we call as a residual magnetic flux that will come into the play at the initial stage and once motor starts rotating then it will develop a emf which will feed this field winding for production of more flux so let's write current and voltage equations for this so it's very simple at this junction if i apply kcl i'll come to know ia equal to il plus if and this if can be given as vt upon rsh so if depends upon vt voltage equation if i apply kvl in this loop i will get emf induced in the armature which is e equal to vt plus drop across armature ira plus there is small amount of voltage drop across brushes so it's v brush so this is a current and voltage relations in shunt generator let's move to the series generator now so it's very simple in series generator we have field winding in series with armature so the circuit diagram will be like this this is the armature of dc generator to this we are having field winding connected in series and this is connected to a load
आर एस ई इज द रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ फील्ड वाइंडिंग सो हियर आई ए इज द आर्मेचर करंट सेम एज दिस फील्ड करंट सेम एज दिस लोड करंट लोड करंट पासिंग थ्रू लोड विल गिव यूर टर्मिनल वोल्टेज वी टी so here we have to remember field winding is coming in series with the armature therefore it is series generator let's write voltage and current relations as i said earlier armature current is same as field current सेम एस लोड करंट आई एल नाउ वोल्टेज इक्वेशन वी हैव टू अप्लाई के बी एल टू द लूप गिवन सो ई एम एफ इंड्यूस ई इज नथिंग बट टर्मिनल वोल्टेज वी टी प्लस ड्रॉप अक्रॉस आर्मेचर प्लस ड्रॉप अक्रॉस फील्ड वाइंडिंग बिकॉज फील्ड वाइंडिंग इज इन सीरीज विथ इट सो राइट हियर इट इज आई ए multiplied by rse plus small amount of voltage drop across brush so that is v brush so i can say over here emf induced equal to vt plus if i take i common in bracket ra plus rse plus v brush so this is a emf equation of series generator thank you